my gosh guys it's finally here animal crossing new horizons i've been waiting six years for this game it's been incredible and what a heck of a couple of weeks it has been i'm just glad to be in my house right now getting ready to play this game we're gonna have a great time today i promise you <laughs> oh my gosh how cute they are <laughs> knock on the poster in the background sounds okay i'm gonna have to like mute it because um nintendo hates people who make uh, nintendo content on youtube so i'm gonna have to like take all of the audio out but oh my gosh i can't <laughs> i can't let us be the first to congratulate you on your wise decision to sign up for this adventure Welcome to the check-in counter for your deserted island getaway package. There is so much to look forward to, but first, let us introduce ourselves. I'm Timmy with Nook Inc. And I'm Tommy. We'll be flying to the island with you to help you get settled. Think of us as your partners. We're in it for the long haul, so let's get started, shall we? Now then, we'll need to look up your application. Can we have your name and birthday? Limey. Limey, Limey, let's see. Next step will be to take a picture of you, Limey. Oh, don't worry, take as much time as you need to get yourself looking just the way you want. We'll be ready when you are, you are. Okay, so we get to customize ourselves now. I'm more interested in the hair types. I'm thinking this one. I might use those because they go with the art that you see in the top corner there. The art is made by our door frame and they gave me permission to use this on the, t the uh, framing for this video. And then triangle nose classic and then for the mouth we'll maybe go for the squiggly. Great! You're all set! All set. I'll just go ahead and add that picture to your records. And now, let's start talking about your new home. So exciting. Exciting. <laughs> You'll see we're quite proud of the work we've done to help you feel comfortable in your new life. Oh yes, in fact, if you want, you can even experience the seasons the same way you're used to them. What I mean is, we have islands in the, both the Northern Hemisphere and the Southern. Where do you live now? Live now. I live in Europe. I'll show you some maps now, and you can choose the best one for your new home. New home! <laughs> Ooh, okay, let's pick this one. Yes. Yep, let's pick this one, and hopefully we get a good uh, choice of native fruit, hopefully. Final question for you. If you could only bring one thing with you to a deserted island, what would it be? What would it be? A sleeping bag, a lamp, some food, something to kill time. <laughs> um... Probably food. <laughs> that was a hypothetical question. Nook Inc. will fully cover all of your basic needs. Yes, yes. Attention, please. The chartered flight for Nook Inc.'s deserted island getaway package is ready for boarding. Any customers waiting to board should make their way to the gate at this time. Thank you for taking this chartered flight as part of the Nook Inc.'s deserted island getaway package. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy a complimentary video presentation about deserted island life. Ooh, relaxing. Oh, she looks chill. Look at the chessboard and the little sandals. <laughs> this is so cute. Oh, we're flying over the island. We have peaches. Oh my gosh, yes. We have peaches. That was one of the fruits I was wanting, either peaches or cherries. So we got peaches because I haven't had peaches before. I've had oranges, apples, and also pears, but I've never had peaches or cherries, so I'm really glad that I got peaches. We're here. Now I know you must be incredibly excited to explore your new island home, but I have one small request. Would you please join us for a short orientation session in the nearby plaza? Our fearless leader himself will be giving a presentation, so I'd hate for you to miss it. We're heading there right now if you'd like to move with L stick to follow us. Who do we have here? Who are you? You're Tad. Follow the guides. Let's hustle. And you are Shari? Oh my gosh. This is... I'm actually moving around in an Animal Crossing game. <laughs> Alright, is that everyone? Let's see. Is Shari here? Shari is here. And how about Tad? And there's Limey, of course. Hello. Great, we're all here. I'll turn it over to you, Mr. Nook. Our three adventures are ready to get started. <laughs> yes, yes, very good. Let's see, how shall I begin? 
Yes, of course. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to your new island. My name is Tom Nook, and I'm the founder and president of Nook Inc. Yes, yes. Today is the first day of your new life on this pristine, lovely island, so congratulations. And this is a package deal, hmm? And such, Nook Inc. staff will always be here to support you and ensure your comfort and safety. But, first thing first, yes, yes. I'd like each of you to choose a spot of your own. It's the first step to putting down some real roots. I'd like you to dream big. I do have certain connections in construction and real estate and... Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's just get started with a simple tent, shall we? Please collect your tent from Timmy and Tommy and then choose a spot to place it. Oh, and Shari looks like she is uh, needing our help, I think. Yo, wait, I got it. Don't tell me. You're Limey, right? See, told you I had it. I'm sorry, I gotta tell you, I'm excited to do this whole island thing, cheeky, just got a phone call, but I'm back. Looks like we're both having trouble deciding where to set up our tents. I mean, it's a pretty big decision. Of course, no matter where we settle down on this little island, at least we'll be neighbours. That's not too bad, um, but I think it's kind of quite cramped in there. Can we get it to fit like here, maybe? Okay, I think this is a spot. I'm quite happy with this now. I set up my tent, that's a big first step. I'll find you a spot. You're just gonna line the houses up uh, like a street, I think. Just so it's a little bit organized. Yeah, okay, let's put that there and then we'll put the others in a row as well. Okay, yeah, I think that is pretty much perfect. So let's get them moved in right there. Of course, you can sleep on it for a while. Hmm, really get a feel for it, how it suits you. And with that taken care of, we can move on to more serious business. Like throwing an island warming party, we'll have it right here in the plaza with a roaring campfire. Oh my god, s'mores please. We'll just need a few supplies to get started, yeah. Since we'll all be living here together, this will be a good test of our teamwork. Let's see. Timmy, Shari, Tommy and Tad can set up things here in the plaza. Meanwhile, Limey and I will work on gathering firewood and perhaps a little snack. Alright everyone, let's get to it. Ah, Limey, I just wanted to go over what we'll need for the campfire. I think roughly 10 tree branches should do the trick. You can find them scattered about the island. So when you find one lying on the ground, just press Y to pick it up. Meanwhile, inv <laughs> Meanwhile in I'll investigate the peach-like items growing in the trees. I suspect they're real peaches. Well, I'd hope so. I'm not exactly sure how many we need, but we're just gonna get quite a few. Get some of our peaches. They do look a bit like bots, don't they? Just a little bit. <laughs> There's a little fish in the water, you see them? Oh, good, good, Limey. It looks like you've managed to collect up the tree branches, hmm? You found even more than I asked. I only need the ten, but I'm sure you'll find good use for the rest. I'll take what we need off your hands now. I couldn't remember how many he said, so I just collected, like, all of the ones I could find. There should be plenty for a campfire. You made quick work of that. I'm quite glad that I'll be sharing this desolate island with such a hard worker. Oh ho! <laughs> and speaking of surviving on a des desolate island, our next task is to round up something to snack on. While you were collecting branches, I was evaluating the fruit that seems to be abundant here. They look like peaches, they smell like peaches, and they even taste like peaches. In fact, they are 100% without a doubt genuine peaches, so will you collect six of them for me? Oh, what's this? You've already collected enough peaches for everyone, haven't you? Well, well, I knew you were the right one for the job. Thank you once again. <laughs> I'll go ahead and take those off your hands and get started on the preparations. Oh, it's all dark. Now, is that everything? Look at the campfire they built up. It's all so lovely. It's going to be very nice and toasty. Screw we the tarantulas. Is that everything? Yes, yes, I believe it is. Let's get started with the festivities. Okay, I'm taking a sip of my tea that I made earlier. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> At last, allow me to properly welcome you to your new island life. I have participated in many ventures and endeavours over the years, but this may be the most exciting. You don't have to tell me twice, Mr. Nook. Helping develop a thriving new community entirely from scratch will truly test my business something and perhaps my skills as an outdoorsman. Hmm? Oh ho. Now we may not have the kind of numbers that I originally envisioned, but that just means we'll have to rise to the challenge. And I have no doubt that with hard work and perseverance we'll shape this deserted island into I suppose we can't call this a deserted island anymore, hmm, but what should we call it? Okay, so I did a poll on Twitter for this. 
and uh, I was deciding, oh my gosh, I was deciding between Lenora and also like something else, I can't remember it, but the one I'm going for is Lenora because uh, you've voted for that one. But also I like it more than the one, the other one that was on there. Let me actually go check that poll. Oh, okay, so the poll says Lenora and Serif. Serif is a type of shell and Lenora means light. I wanted to ask you guys which one you think uh, would be a cool name for this place and I really like Lenora anyway, so that's the one we're gonna go for. As the first residents of this island, we should be the ones to name it. And in the spirit of democracy, we should put it to a vote. Majority rules, hmm? So take a little time to think, and when everyone is ready, I'll present your ideas. Are you okay with Lenora? The world of Animal Crossing is welcoming to all, so don't include personal info or offensive words. Is everyone ready? Let's try saying our ideas all at the same time. Ready? Go. Awesome Beach, Rackland, New Kits, and I couldn't see the other one. <laughs> what splendid variety, yes, yes, each one a potential gem. <laughs> for the voting, I'll say each name in order and you can clap for the one you think is best. Can I vote for my own? Everyone wants the name! Yes. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, the little smiles, I can't. This, it's just like stuff like this, it makes me love this franchise and this game so, so much. That's an overwhelmingly positive response. Each and every one of you claps. I suppose if everyone is in agreement, we could just go with Lenora. It rocks, that was great, absolutely. Okay, splendid. Then from now on, this island will be known as Lenora. Well, Limey. Since you've proven yourself by naming Lenora, I'd like to rely on you for other critical decisions we'll need to make on this island. Yes, yes, I'll hereby name you the president representative of Lenora. Wow, president representative. Are we the president? <laughs> Last time it was mayor and now we're president? <laughs> Amazing. Okay, Limey, could you please say a word or two as the new spokesperson for your neighbours? Howdy, a word or two, you can count on me. <laughs> oh, it's resident. I've been saying president, but I'm just gonna say we're the president anyway, you know? <laughs> oh, look at the little tambourine. <laughs> oh, wow. The fire sounds, the atmosphere with the, the wind blowing through the trees, the tambourine, and the very like, um, muted stereo sound it's beautiful it's good to me but first you'll probably want this what is it is it a sleeping bag camping cot you want to set it up in your tent before you lie down oh and there are a few packages waiting in your tent as well hmm? just a few items that might be useful so open packages and use the things inside press a and when you're ready you can move out to crawl into bed We've got another big day ahead of us tomorrow, so rest up as much as you can tonight. Yes, yes, that's all from me for now. Sweet dreams, Limey. Oh, so sweet. Look how the lighting bounces off the wall and everything. Oh gosh, this is gorgeous. Okay. There we go. Let's take a snooze. Rest my head for a little while. Yes. KK Slider! Oh, hello! So, looks like you've decided to make your own way in the world. Get out there, explore new frontiers. That's all the way, <laughs> that's all the way right, daddy-o. You don't need to live by anyone's rules, but your own. The world was made for exploring, you know? Living free, being out there, it's a great feeling. Yeah, but take it from a cat who's been on the road. You're not a cat. <laughs> being by your lonesome can grind on the salt. You've got to make friends along the way. Rambling this crazy world is Squaresville without some pals. Yeah, man, friends are where it's at. Speaking of rambling, I'm doing a bit of that myself. My bad. Maybe it's about time for you to wake up to your new life. Oh, but listen up. That rap I just gave you about friends is pretty key. You'll dig this island life a whole lot more if you share it with some friends, if that's your scene. Yeah. An island paradise with your best pal sounds pretty groovy to me. Cool. When you wake up, you'll be in sync with real time. Dig that island life and I'll catch you later. Bye, Mr. KK Slider. Are you in there? Oh, I hope I haven't woken you abruptly. Ah, but I do wish to discuss something with you. Yes, yes, I'll be here when you're ready. Ah, uh, there you are. 
I hope you had a pleasant nap. Oh well, I suppose it was a bit more than a nap, wasn't it? It's a brand new day. I slept that long? Oh, oh, oh yes, it's quite normal to be worn out from such a long trip and a major life event. Speaking of which, I have a few more things that you might find useful as you adjust to life in our little paradise. First you'll need one of these, yes? Ooh, he's giving us a phone. Nook phone, I had these made especially for island residents. Ah, I want to make sure it's working right, so could you try turning it on for me? Hmm. Oh, there it is. Welcome. My new life is underway. I can do whatever I want. Woohoo. Now on, island time will match the flow of time in the real world. Do not touch the power button when you see the autosave indicator in the top right screen corner. You can also save and quit your game after pressing n minus. What we have. Nintendo, thank you for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a present to show you our appreciation. Please keep an eye out for future updates as well. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that is sure to come in handy. Nintendo Switch? Oh, jeez. And a simple DIY workbench. We'll put it there, I guess, for now. <laughs> That'll do. And we'll put the workbench maybe, like, right next to our tent. I'm getting a real good vibe from the template you picked for me. Thanks for the hands. We gotta look out for each other. Hey, if you ever need anything, do be shy, cheeky. Oh yeah, I was thinking about how to thank you and I came up with a recipe for a leaf umbrella. Ooh. Oh, I just need two branches and I have enough. Okay. Woo. Yay. Oh, they were clapping for me. Thank you. Oh, hello, friend. Tad, are you gonna give us something too? Ooh, a hat. Tulip hat. Ooh, that's going to keep the sun off our face. You've enrolled in the Nook Mileage program. Earn Nook Miles for completing island activities. Then trade those miles for various perks and goods at the Nook Stop in the Resident Services Centre. Oh, Nook's drinking a little can of, like, something. Cute. Oh, the animations. We've got a tadpole. So cute. Just a tad small. <laughs> oh, it's a dab. Yes, dab, not bad. <laughs> Got another dab. You can sneak and swing and get it. There we go. This is a tiger butterfly. What's this? A crucian carp. My skills are sharp. <laughs> Shari's going fishing too. Oh, that might be a good throw. Oh, he bit straight down on that one. What did we get? Is that a new fish? He's got like green thing. He's got. Oh, it's no, it's a black bass. Oh, <laughs> that's not a new fish at all. Oh, an old boot. You could probably wear those if I found another boot, right? I've got an idea for a DIY recipe. Oh. A bitterling. He's cute. Get this common butterfly. Oh, whoops, I missed. Oh, no. Son of a carp? Yes. Oh, what are you? You're a new fish. A loach. Not to this game, but uh, what we haven't caught. Oh, you see the balloon with the present? We can't get that yet, but... A honeybee. Sweet success. Gonna need to shake some trees. Oh, money. Ah! Old trick. <laughs> I was wondering if that was gonna work. Oh my gosh. That was scary. Can pick up the honeycomb at least. Yes! I got another boot! Let's see what we can. Oh, there's the other common butterfly. <laughs> Recycled boots! Let's craft them. Let's put them on. Oh yes, funky. Ooh, is that a new fish? Yellow perch, I think that's a new fish. Got a horse mackerel, of course, mack L. That's a new fish. Oh, that's definitely a new fish. I've never seen that before. Pop-eyed goldfish. 
maybe that was in the previous game. Got the designs tab. We have quite a lot of room for designs. And I actually want to do a segment where if you guys want to send in any QR codes or anything in future, and also for any art relating to Animal Crossing, you can send to me on Twitter at Bamit's Doodles. Love to show them off in videos and just uh, give you guys a little of uh, attention for your art and stuff because I'm sure you are so talented. Let's try this one. Look, display on ground, little paw prints. It looks like someone's gone fishing there. Oh, that is so adorable. Oh, how scary is this filter? Ooh, spooky. You could do some spooky films and stuff with this. All right, I am gonna finish this uh, episode here because it has been running on for quite a while. I imagine it's gonna be quite a long episode. But like I said before, make sure to send in some arts or QR codes or patterns that you make if you wanna uh, send them to me on Twitter at Barrett's Doodles. Uh, I'd love to feature them in the video and show them off. But I am gonna continue playing and get up my bells and I will, you know, update you in a video tomorrow about progress and stuff. But I do hope you enjoyed this first episode, uh, mostly just setting up and getting ready to start daily life here. Uh, it's gonna be incredible and I am so excited to continue playing this game. It's so relaxing, so much fun. But uh, thank you all so much for watching. I would really, really appreciate it if you would like to subscribe to the channel. And yeah, I just want to say thank you for watching. And I will see you in my next episode. Goodbye.